从业近六十年来，美国资深调查记者西摩赫什曾多次揭露了美国政府和军方的秘密行动和丑闻。一九七零年，赫什率先报道美军在越南战争中制造美莱村屠杀，此事在美国国内激化强烈反战情绪，在一定程度上起到了终结越战的作用。1974年，赫什参与报道尼克松政府的水门事件，揭露了中情局和联邦调查局特工长期对政治对手实施窃听、监视和其他非法行动。2004年，赫什报道了美军在阿布格莱布监狱的虐囚丑闻，让美国政府所谓的人权卫士的形象轰然倒塌。2023年2月8号，赫什发布调查报告指出，北溪天然气管道爆炸事件的幕后真凶是美国。根据赫什的调查，早在北溪管道被炸前九个多月的2021年12月，美国情报部门就开始策划破坏北溪管道，然后逐步将计划付诸实施。文章发表后，美国白宫、中情局和国务院均予以否认。就此，我们对赫什的专访也从北溪管道事件展开。We know that it had been like more than one month's time since your first article about, you know, North Stream pipeline destruction. So, is there any latest details that you can share with us today, or as you emphasized before, the revealing is just as a kind of initial stage. We can expect more in your coming articles. We'll see what happens with the the pipeline story. The White House has absolutely denied it and said nothing else. Uh, uh, I wish. Some of the reporters who cover the White House, like I once did for the New York Times, very briefly, was a horrible thing place to be. You absolutely beat、um, you. Were, anyway, I just didn't like it.、Um, but one of the, re- I think one day one reporter might ask the White House, since the president, as as the commander in chief of the United States and also the head of the of everything in the, the government, he can use the word that、uh, the word of art is tasking. He can task the American intelligence、uh, community. Uh, the CIA has a, an intelligence directive.、Uh, the military has a dead intelligence service. Task them to do a big study and find out who actually did it, because we have all the、uh, assets. We have signals intelligence. We can intercept. If you ask that question, you might not be allowed to ask any more questions in the White House. But you certainly won't get an answer because the answer is they've not asked anybody. Why haven't they asked? Because they know the story. Look, it's a, it's a, it's a story that. They're going to deny with every breath they have, and I've told reporters that the pipeline community, the men who own companies that build pipelines, and、um, pipelines are now there's now twelve more than twelve thousand miles of pipelines of, of moving gas and oil, and there's a big industry, and there's a, a a lot of companies that work in pipelines and know the pipeline business. They all. Uh, so I have very good reason to believe, more than very good reason. So I have empirical stuff, but I can't make it public. I can't embarrass anybody. They all knew who did it. I mean, who else would have done it? But it's fallen away. Although they th- they had a lot of hope for it in the White House, I thought. I, so I'm told. I've been doing this for 50. Years. I've seen it before. I write stories nobody believes. You know, when I first wrote the story about the massacre、uh, in My Lai. More than half of America thought I, you know, should go into jail for it or something like that. 赫什的调查文章发表后，美国多数媒体对这一话题一度视而不见，之后又抛出一套全新说辞。为此，央视记者十八号也采访了前五角大楼顾问、麻省理工学院教授泰奥多尔·波斯托尔。波斯托尔称。赫什在撰写北溪事件调查时，曾经向他求证过炸毁北溪管道是否可行。Hirsch reports that they dropped the sonoboy in the water to trigger the mines. Well, to a non-expert, that seems like a straightforward thing. To an expert, that is not straightforward because the sonoboy emits, and the sound. Let's say here's the mine. The, son,、uh, the mine gets a signal from the sonoboy. But it also gets a signal that bounces off the bottom of the shallow water, shallow water, bounces off the surface, and bounces back. To, so it gets a mix of signals, and the mix of signals can be many. Diff- so I need a very sophisticated system to recognize that this is the pulse you intended to send, and it has to be sophisticated enough to not mistake that pulse for other sound sources that are from all over. So, so it's a comp. It, it's straightforward、uh, technology for today, 
but it's not in everything. To determine that the water depth was about 260 feet, so that's maybe 80 meters. That's very deep for diving. Uh, what happens when you dive is the pressure of the gas in your body gets compressed by the outside pressure. You get up to about eight atmospheres of pressure. This causes the oxygen to be forced into your body's cells and, and causes oxygen poisoning. It's, it's known among, uh, uh, among uh, advanced divers, you know, specialists, And uh, and you can only operate for a short time at these depths. 波斯托尔说，导致北溪管道被破坏的爆炸装置重量都很大，只靠单人无法完成，必须有类似小型单人潜艇、减压舱等专门设备的配合才行。So if the if the if the mine weighs two、uh, hundred kilograms,、um, that means in the water it's going to weigh one hundred kilograms. It's the buoyancy is only going to take half of its weight. That's still pretty heavy. So how do you handle this? Well, you probably have some kind of specialized underwater equipment, you know, like a little、uh, one-man submarine or some kind of device.、It、can be any kind. You know, there there are hundreds of kinds of devices that have been invented over many years of deep diving. I, I have no way of knowing what it was, but they must have had this kind of device working. They also had a decompression chamber underneath the.、Uh, Because when these when these people come up, they die, unless they have a decompression chamber. They can come up very slowly, but if they come up very slowly, the time of the operation becomes extremely long, and the danger becomes much longer. Because if you somehow made a mistake and you needed a longer time for decompression, you may not have it. So having a decompression chamber is critical. With, you know, if you're going to keep the diver, you know, you're going to protect the divers from from dying. Bostor 还表示。如此精密的行动，必须是非常先进的工业国家才行。Who has this kind of capability except a country like the United States? Advanced industrial countries that have this capability, but、um, but they're states. They're not a group of people on a yacht like the New York Times.、Uh, pathetically, it was a pathetic discussion. First of all, it was bad journalism from the beginning to the end. First, they did not acknowledge. That Hirsch had written this article. They said there was nothing there. It's 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 beyond、uh, bad. I mean, it's、uh, the New York Times is guilty of this. I mean, very guilty of this. There are articles on subjects that I deeply、uh, that I'm deeply knowledgeable about that I would not call wrong. I would call them fabricated. 对此，赫什也表示。自己的调查报道是从专业角度几经核实才完成的。Hirsch, I, I talked to Mr. Posto, you know, with some related topics、uh, the other day. Who is, of course, one of your close friend. He also mentioned that, you know, the discussion before you review the original article, you know, through several rounds of confirmation, he was convinced by, you know, from professional technical perspective that it must be U.S. government who planned and implemented the action. So is this kind of very careful and prudent spirit you always uphold when revealing hot topics by protecting your source? He once been the science advisor to the chief of naval operations. He was the senior advisor to the chief of naval operations in the Pentagon on uh, on uh, on nuclear matters, on nuclear weapons and nuclear、uh, the ability to have defensive weapons, what we call Star Wars. And、uh, he was a, a great expert in technical stuff. So naturally, when I got into a question about using underwater sonars to trigger a bomb, that's a very complicated decision. It's not easy. So I spent the, and yes, he was in Washington. We spent the day. He sent me, you know, if you, Mr. Ted Postel is one of those people. If he you get interested in something, you're going to get you know 30 pages of uh, of uh, email. He gave me a long account of what's possible, and it turned out one of the Methods he thought was possible was in fact the method that was used—a very simple method. You、uh, you have, and by the way, the notion that four four or five people in a yacht—the story that the, that was put out the other week—I'm not sure our, what our CIA thought about it, but whatever it was, I don't think it was very positive because it's a very stupid story. And uh, uh, about some yacht that was that was uh, found uh, abandoned, <laughs> and. Uh, 
There was TNT on a desktop as if TNT would last underwater. As long as this stuff was underwater for three or four months, it was a plastique, uh, not not TNT. They did the story that was published by the, my old newspaper about the uh, about that yacht um, met no professional standard that I know of. It was that defective. It was just gossip put together. And um, uh, uh, and by the way, with three unnamed sources, the same complaint they make about me. I probably wrote, I don't know, I, I guess 800 stories uh, in my uh, eight, seven, eight years there. And I think maybe five or six had a named source. Unnamed sources is the only way you can write a story from inside the American government. What does it mean that the White House has done no investigation of what happened? What else can it mean? 赤五号贺时发表了一篇最新文章，文章披露，白宫对苏联或者俄罗斯能源的敌意早已有之。早在上世纪八十年代，里根政府时期，美国就曾试图阻止苏联修建像欧洲的输气管道。随后的几十年来